Axel is here. We are gonna see the um, tutorial today. I'm gonna see. Yes, we are in, in a real flow 2015. So we need to create a new project. So type here the name of the project. So text. And we're gonna save it in our folder. So we're go, gonna put here in this D and we're gonna see the text real flow extension. So create a new and now well, we have uh, our project done and we're gonna start to do so I'm gonna make a geometry, a plane and so I'm gonna scale this and see the visualization here um gonna create a new text so I'm gonna change the scale here I'm gonna put 1.5 and gonna see the quality that's okay so I will check the combining and uncheck the create multi body okay so I'm gonna create the text so here I'm gonna type texto dissolvendo ok so this means dissolving text ok in English so I'm gonna scale again and so we can see here in the relationship we have uh, the plane and the text here so I'm gonna put uh, my text uh, above so I'm gonna put here and now I'm gonna uh, put fill diverso uh, so this fill he, he fill the, all the text inside so then I can see uh, here on the bottom I will change the sub steps 10 and 10 to make it more precise than we have the default, right? So, uh, one more. Uh, I, go, I no need more to see the text, uh, just the the diverse text, and I will put the plane into the, the domain. So I will plug it in, and I'm gonna go to diamonds and put the gravity and connect to the domain again and let's see what's gonna happen so the text is falling down and here you collide into the plane so I'm gonna reset this okay so I'm gonna create uh, another diamond, the noisy field. The noisy field is uh, you plug in domain as well. So the dom this noisy field, he, he will make the particles make some frequency and some noise. So the effect I want to do is when the the noise field uh, pass to the text he you dissolve the text okay so this I uh, enable the fall off and you can see the squares around so I will animate this when the in the position okay so I'm gonna put set the keyframes and the position at frame 10 then I'm gonna put at the frame 30. I'm gonna put down. Okay. And let's see what we have. Okay. So, not bad. Um, I need to reset. Right? To see this better. Okay. Now well, let's do again. Cool. So the problem is here is I have the gravity 
uh, as well so the gravity and the noise is doing the same timing so what I want to do is first uh, the the text will dissolve then the, she, uh, they will going down okay nice so I'm gonna change this graph for the gravity I'm gonna uh, set the key right so I'm gonna animate this just for this uh, effect cool nice so we can see the the graph is not acting in the in my, in my particle so what I can do now is I'm gonna set the key to, to the strength will activate and then put it again 9.8 right cool nice so uh, we gonna see again we gonna simulate let's see what we have so the text is not moving so then the noise field uh, the song the text and then the gravity starts to make uh, the effect nice so this is what I want and um, now what I, we need to do is um, create the, the mesh well first of all we can see the particle is lined on the floor so I want to control this so it's not sliding too much uh, what I, we can do here so I will change the a little bit the, the frames okay let's change the view again cool so uh, I'm gonna select the plane, go to object and diverse. Uh, I'm gonna die friction and I will change the values here. I'm gonna point 0, point 0, 0, 1. Okay, that's what we have. nice so we're gonna see the the particle is not sliding too much now it's sticking from the floor okay so it sticks to the floor right cool that's with the effect I want nice so now we are ready to get the mesh so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna to go to mesh java particle mesh I'm gonna click this and then he is put already into the domain okay so now I'm just gonna build the mesh but we can see nice now we have the the mesh of our text so we don't need to see the emitter and domain from the verso. I just need the this, uh, this mesh. So I'm gonna see the render for uh, Hellflow 2015. You can uh, render from the directly from the real flow. So we can change it. And you can put the the shaders. We have some presets already here, so we can see. Let's I'm gonna put this gold, uh, honey, honey, uh, and I don't need to see the domain anymore. I don't need to see the particles. So just the mesh. Cool. I'm gonna press F6 and he opened this window the render window and this is real time this is very cool you can change any, any position of the camera 
and then we can you can see what's gonna happen cool so then what we can do is render prepare for render our our test for animation very simple this I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and first I'm uh, gonna create the the mesh sequence so just just press the building mesh and then he starts automatically to to build this what you can see here is the machine is following the, the particles the particles is hiding but no no problem right cool now uh, I'm gonna stop this until the the mesh all mesh is done and then I'm gonna back cool now we back again so all the mesh is done so I can prepare for the render the final render to have our video cool so I'm gonna press the the render tab and I'm gonna press the render button he opened this window for us uh, we can change here the time so Maxwell uh, they he interprets the the render from the time uh, you have the so if you have uh, put more time you get better results here you can put where you are gonna save your, your render so cool so just press the render button and you can see this nice so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial sorry for my English for a long time I don't practice this so I will try to do my best so if you like this tutorial Please subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna do more English tutorials for you. Okay, cheers. Bye.